Hello everyone and welcome back to Legends Closet. So thank you very much for tuning in. I'm your host Tim. So this is another one of those videos with a whole bunch of toys and stuff. So I do apologize. I just got off of work and you know just got done eating and things just kind of decided you know make a VHS video make a toy video get them out of the way it's been a couple weeks it's been a while you guys haven't seen me in a while so this one right here probably my new favorite toy I don't think I'm gonna sell him even though he's only worth about a few bucks anyway huh come on you on my finger all right I'm trying to get him on my finger there we go all right this is my favorite toy right now so I forgot what they're called that's by Spin Master. Scritters, there we go. So Scritters. So this is called a Scritter. This one is Bonobo. So if you want Bonobo like this with the tail and everything, he's probably my favorite one. He can grab cookies for you, chips, snacks, whatever. He'll put them right there in those claws and all you gotta do is just grab them and take them wherever you wanna go. So we'll leave him do his thing for a while. Right here. This is a Pokemon Mega Bracelet. I had to look this up and find that out on my own. Pretty good at finding things. I've been doing it for a couple of years now. But this, it lights up red or maybe other colors. But I've been seeing a lot of red. So I think only red. It does not really do anything else. But it's going for about, you know, 8 10 bucks. I paid less than a dollar for it. I got it all in the same $3 bag. These two right here I had to look up. I was scared I wasn't going to find them. I thought they were customs. These are from, uh, uh, I think it was called like Brato or something like that. But anyways, they have Teenage Mutant Ninja Turtle version of this. And uh, maybe some other ones. But they're, basically you plug them in, charge them up, you put them out, you have a controller, and they fight each other. So you can customize them, fight them, however you want. So... This right here, if you know Minecraft, this is going to go in the bag of Minecraft stuff that I have and I'm putting together to sell because, you know, I get about one, maybe two every eight months. I mean, honestly, Minecraft with being new with the toys, you're not going to see a lot of these at the thrift store. And if you do, grab it because you're going to be lucky as it is. Unless there's a whole bunch of junk. If you got a whole bunch of dinosaurs, a whole bunch of fish and random stuff, like, like if you're getting all this McDonald's stuff like here with a cow, then, you know, don't do it. Unless you really, really want this toy like me. Look at this. It's broken. But again, it looks pretty cool. He's frozen. I'm going to put him up, you know, somewhere on display. She's going to go in my PJ Mask collection of stuff that I'm selling. This right here, that's going to go with my uh, Paw Patrol. Sorry, like I said, just got off of work and everything. I worked for a couple of jobs. Right here, we got Hallmark, Itty Bitties, Batman. I'm always finding Batman. He's probably like the number one thing found. I'm going to probably see what he's worth one day. But right now, he's going to go with my other stuff. Boom. Okay, so let's go ahead and... This oh, sorry, I missed one thing. First, he's having fun over here. He's having a party over there. Okay. I'm trying to find... There we go. He, he's having a party over there. Let's get him off for a second so we can concentrate. All right, I'm trying to find what I grabbed. Here we go. So this right here is a stormtrooper. I don't know which one. Has this really cool cloak. So I had to have that in the bag with the bonobo, the PJ mask, the Paw Patrol, these Bratos or whatever it was called. I keep forgetting what company made it. But again, look up the Knight and Viking and that's what those are. That's the Knight and Viking. So if you've already put it in the comments below, I understand. Most people don't comment, so I'm not worried about that. Got a nice little gold shiny gun. Let's get into this mystery bag, alright. Tonka. That's right. I had to buy it for that. This is trash. 
The cow is trash. I wanted to get a better look at this. Growing shark egg. This was buried in there. So warm, fuzzy is the name of the company. Making nature fun. Oh yeah, I cannot wait to give this to some young child to get into nature. So this right here, growing shark egg, add water. 12 to 24 hours. After 48 hours, you get a shark, but don't swallow. Okay, that is awesome. I am so excited for that. I might even open that up and do it myself. Do you want to see how it goes? Let us know in the comments below. This fish I need to fix a little bit, but he, he's like. <laughs> that for some reason was in the bag, okay? What am I gonna do? So I'm trying to get a better look at this. Busby toys, okay. So it looks like you pull back, put some darts in there, shoot it off. I have a lot of nerfs. I'm gonna have to learn more on the Busby toys here. I knew this was a hex bug. I don't know if it requires a uh, controller. It looks like the ladybug. So I'm guessing not. I'm gonna look at closer here. I'm not seeing anything plugging in or anything that I can... There's honestly, I can't do anything with it. All I can do is just push it across. There's no switches, nothing. So I'm going to learn more about that one specifically. Now for those that are in the DC, sorry it took so long to get to this, but here's the flash. I'm not sure which figure it is until I uh, do more research. Which I'm looking at the back of it just says China on the legs. On the legs right here. You have DC Comics. That's about it. With the season and the number. So I'm going to have to do a lot of research for that. This is a flower. Probably trash. Uh, McDonald's. So it's trash. Yeah. Uh, one of these things. I don't know if you've ever played with these back in the 90s. These are a lot of fun. Oh my goodness, look at this. Can I get it even one basket in? Yes, I got a double basket. Oh, there's another one. The green's winning. There we go, yellow's catching up now. Red dunking in, look at that. Let's go. Let's go all day long with them water games. Okay, so I used to play with these when I was a kid. Back when you were getting in trouble at school. Uh, let's see here. What do we got here? We got another McDonald's toy, but I collect Teenage Mutant Ninja Turtle McDonald's toys loose. So I can put them all together. This one will go with all the rest of them. Shout out to anybody that has the, uh, oh man, I almost lost it. Uh, shout out to anybody that has the Teenage Mutant Ninja Turtles version of the Hot Wheels. I'm still trying to collect all of those. Star Wars. Probably not worth much. Oh, it's actually made by Hasbro. Okay. Okay, so it's made by Hasbro. So that means that this right here is actually not a McDonald's toy. So it's not trash. It's actually worth about 25, 50 cents. <laughs> That's good. Uh, so I did not know this was in the bag. That's a surprise. This is a uh, puppy power or puppy something. Uh, Pow puppies. I forget. I got two or three of these. He's going to go with the rest of those so I can finally sell it. I knew about this. So for those of you that know who Donkey is from Shrek, I have no idea what this is, but he is going on display in my house. And if you look, he has... Okay, so to you it has no eyes, but he really does have eyes. It's just that I have the worst... <sighs> I have the uh, worst camera ever. Not much to this. I'm guessing it's another kid's toy. Yep, Burger King. Alright, another McDonald's toy, Luca. And then this one right here I wanted to get a better look at. Because this is Ben 10. So for those of you that are fans of Ben 10, figures at the very end. I don't know what this is. It looks like a squid or something. So, uh, yeah. That's one of the reasons I bought the bag. So, with everything together, I probably got it all about... Oof. 
25 cents or less each which is really good so yeah hopefully uh some of you want stuff like this if you do please message me correctly and uh be happy to help you i am not going to give my age i'm not going to uh tell you much about my information other than i am your host tim matthew is the other host so if you notice a difference in the talking if you notice anything other than john cena or the plaid then uh you know it's my brother matthew so yeah anyways thank you very much for tuning in i'm very happy to uh, open that up i'm surprised way more than you are because the shark all i saw was this i didn't see the shark egg part i just saw this guy right here and do not swallow so i had no idea what i was into i knew about the basketball um anyways thanks for tuning in most of you are probably already done with this video later